hey kids let's learn the image formation in this case in this case we are going to keep our object behind the center of curvature so let's draw an object this is the object i am labeling it as ab and it is kept behind the center of curvature so the object position is behind c now you know that from the object we need to draw two standard incident rays and we need to see where are they meeting after reflection so the first standard incident ray that i am drawing is from point a it is parallel to principal axis and we know that after reflection it will pass from focus i am marking the arrow for the incident ray and the reflected ray another standard incident ray that i am going to draw over here is a ray of light which is passing from focus it will get reflected and will become parallel to principal axis marking the arrow for the incident ray and the reflected ray now kids observe the two reflected rays that is this one and this one they both are meeting at this point and at this point of intersection of the two reflected rays we are going to obtain the image image of point a will be seen over here and you can vertically draw a line like this which will be representing your image of ab because image of a is been obtained over here at the intersection of the two reflecting rays we will label this point as a dash and this point as b dash so this was the object and this is the image of that object coming to the image properties what are you seeing what are you observing let's see what is the image position image bani kahan par hai so image is formed between center of curvature and focus the location of image is between center of curvature and focus so i will write it is formed between c and f what is the nature of this image because again this image is formed as the reflected rays of light are really meeting at this point this image is a real image you know that a real image is always inverted in orientation so real and inverted is the nature what about size of the image so if you compare the height of the object size of the object and size of the image you will see that the image is smaller as compared to that of object so the size will be diminished and thus we understand that when a object is placed behind center of curvature of a concave mirror its image is formed between center of curvature and focus it is real it is inverted and it is diminished i hope you enjoyed watching this video and you have understood this case thank you so much for watching